In my previous video, I showed you uh, how I managed to pull an AC 1.5 kilowatts from the uh, Volkswagen EF. And this video uh, raised some questions that uh, one of it I will try to uh, answer today. If you haven't watched the video, you can check it here. So the first question uh, that raised and I would like to uh, address it in this video is how the uh, high voltage DC to low voltage DC converter kicks in, uh, on which, which condition kicks in to charge the low voltage battery. So this is what we will uh, find out today. To monitor the car battery, I will use the OBD11 uh, connector. Uh, which I will hook to the car and uh, uh, monitor the, the car uh, low voltage battery. Uh, link to the connector you can find on the video description below. So uh, I will hook it into the car and start monitor the car stats. This is the place where the OBD connector here needs to be connected. So I will put it like this and connect the app to the connector. The app is already connected. So to monitor the low voltage battery, we have to go to the battery module, which is this one, battery regulation. And then when it reads all the data from the car, I'm gonna load it. Then we need to go to the live, the live data. And here we need to go to the channel 18, where you can see the uh, battery information. Let's compare it with my multimeter. My multimeter is connected to the uh, low voltage battery. You can see it here. The values are pretty close. 12.73 to 12.736. Uh, so I will use the values from the app because it can give me also what current it drain or uh, charge to the battery and also the battery temperature. So let's go inside the car and see how the battery charging cure. Okay, the car is off. Uh, I think it's draining one amp from the battery because the lights are working, but that's okay. Let's turn the uh, engine on. You can see that right away the DC to DC converter kicks in and started to charge the car with uh, uh, now my lights are turned on I noticed in the previous video that when my lights are turned uh, the headlights are turned on the DC to DC converter kicks in but that's actually not true maybe Maybe uh, I have turned off the car. Let me just put the car in standby, like like pressing the key, just one like this. Okay, you know, so it can show it again, like this. And the car is in standby mode. Now the disc to disc converter doesn't work. And you can see that the car is draining 10 amps from the battery. Even though the lights are not working, let me turn the daylight. Nothing. Nothing here. Nothing here. Let me turn the high beam lights. Okay. High beam lights are working. It's draining. 20 amps from the low voltage battery. Let me turn the engine on. 
Okay, the disc disc converter kicks in and start to char charge the car. Let me uh, loop fast forward to the uh, place where it's charged fully the, the battery. here if I turn them off you can see that it's draining from the battery if I turn them on the yeah, this is the uh, headlights and the uh, daylights now only daylights you see that there is some kind of drain from the battery now headlights only with fog lights nothing the disc, disc converter kicks in and charge the battery but if i turn them off you can see that maybe the consumption of the whole car is very small so it doesn't notice here that there is some drain but you can see that no the charging is charging the car so it's charging all the time it doesn't matter if the lights are uh, on or off yeah i think that this this converter kicks in uh, whenever the car is start and uh, charge the battery and then all the consumption is coming from this converter let me turn on the heater front window heater nothing let me turn to the maximum nothing so the this this converter uh, is working all the time i don't see any uh, drop of the battery uh, what else should i do let me turn on the High beam, light, high beam lights. Let me turn off the lights like this to consume something from the battery, then high beam lamps lights. No, no, not oh, on. This is converter is working all the time. The car, uh, when the car is turned on. So I think that's pretty safe because it will always uh, charge the battery unless you are in standby mode like this in this way the high voltage battery is not uh, turned on and the whole consumption of the car is uh, from the uh, low voltage battery you can see here 10 amps are drained from the battery let me turn on the high beam lights 20 amps let me turn on the hazard lights then the high beam lights so I think this is the easiest way to kill your battery but we should keep in mind that whenever we are in standby mo mode like this the high voltage battery is not working and it's very easy to uh, kill the uh, low voltage battery so I hope you enjoyed the video if you like it give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If I missed something, please type in the comments of the video below uh, what I did I missed and I will try to cover it in the next video. Bye.